When today Melbourne won their first game over Hawthorne at Waverley Park, demolishing the Hawks who have more injury concerns. The Demons jumped their opponents, kicking nine goals to one in the opening quarter to set up a 54-point victory. Djakovic and Doyle both finished with four, while Hawks skipper Chris Langford was injured with a hamstring. Dream Orford has the highlights. There was no Dunstall on Hawthorne's forward line, so Paul Hudson took it upon himself to grab some initiative. He kicked all the Hawks' goals to half-time. Goes for goal and kicks it brilliantly. Captain Chris Langford went for a spectacular run out of defence, but in the process tore a hamstring and was on the bench after 13 minutes. If that wasn't bad enough, they faced an avalanche from the Demons. Greg Doyle rucked and kicked three in the first quarter. Gary Lyon set up chances for Djakovic and the full forward was at his best. Oh, don't tell me he's kicked this. He has. He's happy. It's a goal. When things run hot, everything works. Hilton's kick bouncing through and the Demons led by eight goals at quarter time. Coach's expressions told the story of a one-sided half an hour. It was two goals each in the second quarter, despite Hudson, the Hawks a mile behind, and Dunstall could only watch the massacre. There was no coming back for the Hawks, despite the best efforts of some of their stars. He chips it in the wards goal, and he's put it through it. Even some unaccountable misses by Djakovic couldn't stop the Ds running away. He finished with four goals nine. In the last quarter, Jim Stein sealed a nine-goal win with his third for the day, and Melbourne's first win over the Hawks at Waverley. It's important we won. We've got a bye next week, and, uh, and uh, it's nice to go into that, having a rest with two wins under the Drew Morfitt, Seven Nightly News. Do no wrong. The Demons dominated the opening term. Doyle booting three. Doyle swings round on the left foot. He's kicked another one to the Demons. The Hawks suffered an early blow. Captain Chris Langford sidelined with a hamstring injury. But Melbourne had the numbers, kicking nine goals to one by the first break. It bounces. Hudson did his best to boot the Hawks out of trouble, kicking two early in the second. Hudson's kicked another one. But the Demons had all the answers, up by 49 points at the half. There seemed little the underman Hawks could do as the Demons continued to control the match. Oh, Djakovic gets his third. Djakovic dominating up forward. Well, there you go. Missing at the other end, Hawthorne spearhead Jason Dunstall, indicating the nature of the match. Melbourne running out 54-point winners, beating Hawthorne at Waverley Park, for the first time. So Melbourne notched their second win for the season with a 54-point victory over Hawthorne. 